Yeah. He's confused about how to park this parking in the middle of the road on our own side. Interesting. Morning. Yeah. The jewel of the new. What's up? This is energy booster fruit punch. This might be good for you. Hyper Beast? Yeah. That's like from Counter Strike. What? Counter Strike. Vitamins. I mean, you want energy. Might be better for May you. May 2022. That's like this month. Yeah, you don't want to try it? No. No? Yeah, that's. Didn't you want to open a barbershop? Yeah. I said, didn't you want to open a barbershop? Um, I don't think so. I was thinking of it. But, you know. Bedhead. That's cool. <laughs> I got a what? A bunch of everything? I feel like we were like, we have an hour before it gets too hot out. Oh yeah, so it's good. <laughs> I wish I could say that. Yeah. <laughs> I got an hour before it's Yeah, yeah. What does this say? What is that? Cube organizer. I don't know, some sort of organizer. That's a cube shape. Books are cheap if you want to check books. Books and bucks say. You say huh. Um, what is that? It's oh, like when you walk around. How much are your little toys here? Oh, please, please, um, Wait, can I open it to see if it fits? Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Um, give me $3 and all. $3 and all? Yeah. Yeah, sure. You got a little one? We got a lot of kids' clothes here, too. Great. Well, it's probably good for me because it looks small. It does look small. Well, you know, some of them are so big. What do you think, babe? Uh, I'm going to stand out. Oh, cute. <laughs> I'll stand out today. I think so you're going to be super that one safe. I was going to say that to keep for myself, but I guess that would have never fit me. No, this, <laughs> this is good, though, because I need one Use because I, I ride a Segway and people don't see me. Oh, they, don't, they don't. You can't drive anything. And especially at night. Yeah. Oh, no, so like and, people, and, you know, you'd be in trouble if you hit them, but you can't see them. Yeah, I know. And I don't want to feel very bad if somebody hit them. Terrible. Thank you. Bye -bye. You have a good day. All right. I'm awake. They're a nice day. There's too much money. They're not that much. It's 50 bucks. I think the bottom one. What's that? Who cares? No. I did. I did. Yeah, I did. She said make an offer. Doesn't mean she's going to accept it. You don't know. <laughs> What's that? <laughs> would, you, would you cook on a grill with this? Like you no. put it on your grill? No, it looks painted. I don't think you'd want to cook on it. Here. I don't know where you got it. Does she need chairs? That's a cool coffee table. 
It's like reclaimed wood. Excuse me, dear. Oh, you're fine. I don't need a coffee table. Wow. There's something I'd never sell. It's cool though. It's like a signed football? It is. These are cool. Ten dollars. Oh, they spin. That's nifty. Nice toy chest. Money, you know? You gotta do something. Yeah, no, that's true. <laughs> I'm one of these ones that likes to collect boxes. Those are awesome. You like boxes? Great great I'm not a huge boxes. fan of boxes, but I like boxes. If you like you boxes, them, that's you fine. Put, yeah. You keep yeah. your kitchen counter neat. Yeah. Yeah. Hold your knickknacks yeah. and patty yeah. wax. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. I don't have any patty wax. Give a dog a bone. Yeah, I have a dog. Yeah. <laughs> I wasn't spending the money, but I'll try. You're funny. <laughs> she's so much, I'm gonna, she's I'm gonna shockingly, leave, I'm shockingly, shockingly. She's probably like a gazillionaire. Shockingly you know? cheap. Shockingly <laughs> cheap. Nine bucks, really worth my time. Good morning. No. <laughs> Mario, 50 cents. Yeah. Let me get this. How'd she know about your millionaire status? I don't know. She must have found out. She must have looked me up online, I guess. Yeah. There, give her, she'll give you a change. Oh, I got a good dollar. Oh, I Whatever she gave me, that's what it is. She told me it was 50 cents. I didn't count it. Come on by, honey. Yeah, we were going to say. Good morning. 50 cents. Good morning. Without 50 cents, you can go out and. Spend I know. It. And, 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 just don't and spend it all in one place. I can't even afford it. I know. It's crazy. Thank you. Morning. morning. Smart. Keep it all in the garage for when it gets warm. <laughs> <sighs> they have shoes, they. I see. They have a clock. They have a rack. A what? A rack. They have a rack. It's risky. That's interesting. Oh, the donkeys are cute. How cute are these donkeys? Oh, the dog's cute. cute. So you found some cute stuff? Yeah, they're cute. I don't need them, but they're very cute. And this umbrella here, it's a collector's item. Is it cute? Um, yeah. The Wizard of Id. Oh, I remember that. What is the list of it? It's a comic strip. Oh. Okay, so How much is the umbrella? The umbrella's gonna be two dollars. Two dollars? Two dollars. Ow, that's so heavy. How much is this thing? A dollar. A dollar? What about these two pieces? Three dollars Three each for those? How about that out there? That's cool. Donkeys are cute though. I don't know if I want this. Definitely want this. That's cool. This. Maybe not. Yeah. Very nice. Very nice. No, I don't need it. Alright, so I think I'm just gonna get these two for four bucks. Yeah. I don't wanna break them. There we go. 
pull money out of my pocket here. Four dollars. There you go. Thank you. Appreciate that. Did you see this one? Yes, I did. Little pumpkins and. It's very cute. Kind of cool. Two thousand one. Look at this. <laughs> Look at this. This is uh, free money here on the side of the road. Yeah. Let's grab this. Having a terrible time yard selling, but these shares are worth money. If they work. Let's see if they work. Yeah. And they're not perfect. Pretty nice though. Yeah. I will sell those. The litter made. Little costumes for dogs. What? Costumes yeah. for your dogs. You? Lots of costumes. Morning, how are you? Good, how are you? Good. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And did you say you needed a new mailbox? Did yours fall? Ah, it's on the edge of its life, but it's still alive. Blues clues. <laughs> That's smart. Help the doggies. Yeah. Shortage of that, so. This is like, uh, what's that movie? Caddyshack. Oh. <laughs> That's cool. How much are your puppets? Two bucks. Two bucks each. Which one? I'm sorry. A litter mold. How much is that? Oh, that's fifty. I, this is our neighbor's across the street, so that's he bought it. No, it works. He bought it for his cat. I don't know how much he paid for it, but probably more than that. And he said the cat's afraid of it because when it self cleans, it makes like Damn. a buzzing noise. Semi permanent? The cat went in and didn't use it and that was the end Should of that it. be the word semi? He packed it back up and... Huh. What's the difference between demi permanent and semi permanent? I cannot answer that. I have no idea. I wonder if it's a typo. Demi permanent. What's Maybe the, that's a word. What's the pink one say? Demi? Yeah, they both say demi permanent. I've never heard that. Well, now you got me curious. Yeah. Demi. New York, New York. I don't think it's a typo. I think it's semi permanent. Maybe that's like in between semi and fully permanent. I'm trying to see what the difference is. It does come up as semi permanent, but let me see what that means. The word is. My permanent contains no ammonia and the deposits only. It's mixed with a low volume developer. So oh. it's like semi. The okay. Same thing. Similar, yeah, similar to semi then. Okay. Well, look, we learned something today. Yeah. <laughs> I will never have to know again. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. We've wasted space in our brains. You gotta, you gotta be louder. She has hearing aids. She doesn't. I don't know. I you have to, know she needs help. Yeah, you have to be a little closer to. Do you want me to take it out so you can see it? Yeah. Yeah. Where do you see this? Yeah. Where does it say that, Mom? It says, it says, no, it's not, but 
Multi-cat over 15 pounds. So the cat has to weigh over 15 pounds? No, I think it means it can support a cat that's over 15 pounds. I think you're right. Yeah, I that's think... That's one big cat. 15 pounds? Yeah. My friend has 22 pounders at home. Wow. Well, how big? Do you have a cat? I, guess? I do. How, how big? She never weighed it. She never weighed it. <laughs> it's <laughs> probably like 15 pounds. <laughs> what do you take? 24? I, I can't because it's not mine, it's okay. the neighbor's, and I know it works because he wouldn't tell us. Wait for it. So I can't negotiate. Ultimate Lobo. All right, guys, I had to. I'm editing this, and I had to just jump in really quick. Lots more good footage coming up, so keep watching. But, <laughs> like, I didn't find anything I wanted at this yard sale. My mom said 20 on the $50 item. I was like, oh, <laughs> that's a low ball. This is going to get awkward. And I decided to just go sit in the car. I was like, yeah, I'm, I'm done looking anyways. This is a good time to go sit in the car. Well, my mom doesn't resell, right? She, I mean, very rarely she'll sell something she doesn't use anymore. Very, like, passive resell like uh her watch right she'll sell her watch because she wants a new one something like that or her phone so she actually asked the lady to call the neighbor and have him come over to look at this litter box and see if he'd take 20 bucks like i said it was priced at 50. so i sit in the car for like five ten minutes and i look over and i see my mom walking over with this litter box <laughs> i get out and i open the door for it and i'm like mom how much you pay for it she's like 20. <laughs> So she actually like went through all the effort, waited, had the neighbor come over, offered him the 20, somehow convinced him to accept the 20, and now she has a litter made and she did, she's keeping it for herself. But I just thought that was pretty funny. She'd be a really good reseller. Estate sales by change. Oh, you came here? Yeah. Oh, okay. Gave us the stuff in the garage. I think. Gave us the stuff in the garage? What do you mean? Is it half price today? Okay. I'm doing good. My brain. Recognize. Okay. Free stuff, dining table and chairs, piano, organ, sofa, rugs, and clothes. No? No? Alright. That is some sort of a radio. Bofang. One dollar each. They have a lot of stuff. Willow. They have Willow. Cool. You don't remember the movie Willow? No. We used to watch it all the time. Oh, it was a classic. No, nothing over there. Yeah. They still live here. Oh, okay. They sold the house and. Do they have outdoor furniture for sale? No, ma'am. Nothing. Mm -hmm. Nothing. Mm -hmm. Oh, bedrooms have. So. That's cool. There's another one. Where's that? No. Sold. It's all sold. No, this one. I'm sorry. sorry. Oh, okay. There's still, there's still the electric bed, Jason. Yeah. Where's the electric bed? In the other bedroom. Boogie, woogie, woogie, woogie. It's only like four and a half months old on the electric bed. Yeah, it's, they paid almost three for it. Okay, here's your bed. Yay, he's looking for a bed, but I don't. A lot of money. Today price, $1,000. There's not even a headboard. So, yeah. I mean, it's just the bed itself, I guess. I think so. It's a 500 or... Yeah, they're $9.99 normal. Yeah. Nope. 
Look at that. That's a crazy robot vacuum. Where? That Samsung one? Yeah. I've never seen such a... No, probably not. Those costs? No, boss. Chromatic tuner. Yeah? Yeah? Okay. It's like guitar strings, pencil sharpener. Alright, I'll take it. What is this? That is for refilling an HVAC system. Like, uh, Al has one. He used it to fill up his HVAC with, like, Freon. Alright, thank you. Thank you. Hey guys, thanks for coming with me to those yard sales. Pretty wild. I really think it's a cool indication of why you shouldn't quit if you're having a bad yard sale day. Because this had, it's the first half of my, like, yard selling day this Saturday and it started off pretty brutally. I was not finding much of anything. I was buying things just because I wanted to buy things. I'm a bit of a shopaholic, let's be honest. But I wasn't finding hardly anything profitable. I went to this estate sale. I cut out a lot of footage. We were in there for a long time trying really hard to find something good. And I was having no luck at all finding anything good. A bunch of like Marshall's glassware for about the price it costs at Marshall's. Like just, I'm finding nothing. I give up. I say, okay, let's just go. There's nothing for me here. As I'm walking away, I see out of the corner of my eye, OSS. And I thought cost, K-O-S-S, -S, like the headphones. And some cost, like, they're not great, but some can be worth good money. I was like, man, are those headphones? So I turn around and I see it's a Boss guitar pedal at the end there. And of course, when I go look at it and pick it up and I look at the guy in the garage who's running the sale, he's like, oh, you can just have anything, you know, that you want there. Just take it. If you like it, take it. Take the whole box. I'm like, all right, cool. And it like totally changed my perspective. Next video will be after, right? So this was like the first part of Saturday. My next video will be the next part of Saturday and I got a whole bunch of great stuff and did really well the second half of Saturday, like 10.30 and beyond. And all the early stuff I was struggling. So, you know, it's just a good sign like when you're out there and you're like, oh man, I'm finding nothing. There's no good flips out there, just keep going. And something like that can turn your whole day around. Yeah, it's only a $60 guitar pedal, but it was free. So zero to 60, oh, I feel like Nick Cage, right? Zero to 60 in two seconds, <laughs> pretty much, right? <laughs> I need a Shelby GT, is that the car? Sorry, my phone's going off. But either way, I like to put it all out there, guys, to let you see the struggles of uh, reselling every now and then. You go out and you find nothing for a couple hours, and it's brutal and slightly depressing. And then all of a sudden, something can turn around, and sometimes you'll have a whole weekend where it's not great. But it's okay, because you just got to keep trying, get out there, try to find the deals. I actually do like the glass things I got a lot. That pumpkin vase, I did list that. I, there was no similar. I think it might be handmade and kind of unique. So I couldn't find anything similar. So I just listed it, I think for $35, which I'd be happy to get. Uh, hopefully it's not worth like 5,000 and I didn't realize, I don't think it is. Uh, and then I found that blown glass, which I liked because it had like a actual maker on it and stuff. It looks like they sell for between 15 and 30 bucks. So nothing huge there, but I do like selling that sort of stuff. And I thought it was cool to pick up. And of course we got the free lawn chair. The free lawn chairs, I mean, I saw them. That was, so I just left a sale. It's really interesting and I feel like I should save the footage. This has happened twice now. I go to the sale, same lady, different address. And I put it on Instagram and a bunch of people who are local to me said, yeah, I've seen her five times this year, right? So she's somehow running yard sales from like different houses, even though it's the same lady with the same stuff. She pulls her black trailer up and she has the yard sale. These are empty houses. Like you can look in the windows, you see the house is empty. I don't know how she's doing it. But anyways, I had just left that sale. I didn't even put that in here because I found nothing. Everything's price was ridiculous. I guess I could put some of the footage in there. Maybe if I see her again, I'll like spend more time. But I instantly recognized her. I recognized her stuff. So I was like, hey, I'm not going to stay long. So I just bailed. But uh, it was after that and I was like just, I was frustrated because I drove pretty far for it. Same lady I'd seen three weeks before with the same crazy pricing. But then as I'm leaving, I find those, those lawn chairs that I know I can get like 50 bucks for for free on the side of the road. So that was kind of cool. You know, there's always something out there. You just got to keep hunting. I hope you guys enjoyed this. Make sure you subscribe, comment below what your favorite find was, and we'll see you next time. Also, if you have any theories as to how this lady is doing multiple sales every week from different addresses, let me know.